Uh, so I just want to take a little bit of time just to talk about uh, how Blackboard Ultra, the progress and development of the product has uh, supported our staff and students at Northumbria University. Uh, we've been very fortunate. We're one of the very early adopters of Blackboard Ultra, so we've seen a significant amount of change within the product. Um, the management of the SAS uh, as, a, as a whole has been something that Northumbria University have had to get used to doing. And certainly if you're potentially even thinking about moving to SAS, it is a, a step change from actually what might have been previously quarterly updates or however you were running them uh, to that more frequent uh, update. But with it becomes a plethora of advantages in the sense that you're getting the very best product out there and you're, you're actively kind of checking for those release notes on a monthly basis to see what's coming and what can you excite your uh, populace with at the university? What can you really go out there and say, this is new, you should be using this. Um, I just want to talk about a couple of my favorites that I, I've seen throughout the years. Um, first and foremost, uh, absolute game changer was of course when we saw the Microsoft Teams integration and the one no class notebook integration became available both partnerships uh, between uh, Anthology Blackboard and, and Microsoft uh, allowing for this LTI to be made available which for us was a, a real game changer in terms of the abilities and what we could potentially do they came of course with the, the, the fact that we need to really think about what should we be doing in one environment versus the other but that was a welcomed kind of challenge I suppose to add to this as well, um, over the changes we've seen, I absolutely loved the introduction of the uh, ability to record feedback on assessment. So the use of the uh, Blackboard Collaborate instance within assignment feedback. For me personally, uh, as, as a former lecturer myself, this was a bit of a game changer for my ability to actually communicate my feedback back to the students and to really get my message across in, in a sense that also was positive, um, time uh, rich in terms of my ability to very quickly produce uh, some excellent feedback from machines that I know they're going to be engaging with and actually just improving the whole assignment feedback process. Um, coupled with, of course, the improvements to the assignment marking process in terms of the ability to the on-text grading abilities, the ability to attach files and still give that summative feedback that I wanted to at the end. And uh, my last favorite, my unsung hero, which I've got to mention is the uh, the learning modules and the force sequence that um, has been introduced. The ability that I can now decide the path that my students are going to take in order to learn the content that I've uploaded to the VLE, for me, that's a no-brainer, and I've seen that used pedagogically in terms of how, how which books we're giving out in the classroom. So to have that in the electronic format in the VLE is just world-class, really. Um, in terms of our actual overall experience of the updates, it's been very positive. And in fact, the relationship that we've got with Blackboard um, has allowed us to have real confidence that when the updates land, that we can, of course, talk to Blackboard about them and say, hey, how's this going to affect us? And uh, what, what advice would you give us? And vice versa, of course, uh, in terms of our experience of using the product. So that's been very positive overall.